Oh, I'm going to do another video, too. I'm right in the face because niacin rush. That's okay. I took a big dose of it, so. <clears throat> it's supposed to be good for you. Okay? Okay. So, we got this guy on the shock mount. Um, receiver 1051B shock mount. This is a 1051B. U R R. So it's on shock mounts. That's what I did to do to do the little today. Plus I got this fellow in. Uh, R C H Scott Radio Company. No, I guess I'm in the way here. Warship stuff again. Their science was to press fundamental frequencies so that you're not other the enemy you can't pick you up. Now look at this beastie. Uh, heavy as hell, too. Now that's what I call a equipment. Uh, looks okay. No broken things, nothing, just a lot of dust on it. Let me go over here. Navy Department Bureau of Ships. Didn't have a case with it, so I got inspired to get on the saw and cut out a case for it. So that's all sitting in with glued and screwed. Nice fit. It's very heavy. Three quarter inch plywood, and then I'm going to add um, steel pieces here and here tomorrow. And paint it black. So this guy has then got a case. Being rack mountable, what I do is put another piece of plywood in here, kind of back a bit so it fits in, and you can bolt it right in. I've done that before with different things that over the years, so there you have it. I wonder what ship this guy came off of. <laughs> I'll find out, I guess. Yeah. Mm, what do we got here? Oh, chart. See, I spray this stuff with WD-40 and it all comes back to life. You can see it sitting somewhere forever, you know. Everything works fine. Let me tune it. A year in this guy contract. Mm. Mm. Different stages of um, electronics and cannons and artillery on ships. Black mostly for some unknown. Well, yeah, and then to gray, like this guy. And there's more black fellows over there. Ah, oh, I'm gonna do another video. <laughs> Looking red.